This is the science of mercury and mercury poisoning in 60 seconds. We've all heard that too much mercury exposure, especially from fish, can be bad for us. Just like an Entourage star Jeremy Piven's close call back in 2008. But liquid mercury was used as far back as 3,500 years ago and it was found in Egyptian tombs. It's also called Quicksilver, like the X-Man character, because it's fast moving and surprisingly heavy. Originally named after the wing-footed Roman god and our fastest moving planet. It's found in old glass thermometers and new fluorescent bulbs, so if one breaks, don't breathe in the fumes. But why is it dangerous? Mercury can be absorbed through unbroken skin, ingested, or inhaled, and over time, it can lead to health problems and even death. It gets into our water sources and oceans through coal smokestack fumes, along with other poisons. So people that live near the coast or an industrial area are at higher risk. Mercury poisoning can lead to problems with our blood, kidney, and even our brains. And pregnant women need to be extra careful because it can cause severe brain damage in developing fetuses. It's so toxic that an old chemical weapon antidote used in World War II is actually used still to treat serious cases of mercury poisoning. And that's Science in 60. For more Science in 60 Seconds, click the subscribe button. And we'll see you next time.